who's back. Please, have a seat. As always, the tournament buy-in is twenty thousand dollars. I fall. Spicy. Call. I'll call that. I've got a bad feeling about this. You want to pick it up? I checked. Okay, I'll bet. You might want to pace yourself there. I call. 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 and I could repair the Oldsmobile with that money. Nah. Whoa. Big Who is the in the morning. Damn. Oh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> oh, come on. The player has a flush. Brock has to pair. The player wins. That was just all luck. <laughs> I had totally lost that. I was worried you would screw that up again. Don't get cocky, kid. Congratulations. You completed oh. another set nice. of empty challenges. Brock Samson has been eliminated. Brock. Brock, do you require assistance? I'm fine. Hey, Kara, what's up? And yes, luck is a skill, but not usually one that I have at my disposal. Hey Sam, you're technically a cop, right? He's a maniac cop. Yeah, we're cops. Isn't it kind of your job to shut down illegal gambling joints? Well, the inventory's a little out of our jurisdiction. You know the old saying, whatever happens in the omnidimensional accretion nexus stays in the omnidimensional accretion nexus. Nope. <laughs> Very. Checking. Mr. Trap has ace high, and you have a pair of sixes. The player wins. I raise. Okay. I can't even work up the enthusiasm to dismiss these cards with an overwrought simile. You don't like Sam's feet? <laughs> I'll write him a note. Hmm. I knew I should have paid more attention in algebra. All right. All in. Really? Well, that was a clever move that won't come back to bite me more and more Yeah. 
Oh. Well, that sucks. Nope, that still sucks. And dead. Who's your daddy? Well, I didn't go all in, so the player whatever, has I guess. A pair of jacks and Ash has two pair. Ash wins. It's good to be the king. Yeah, I'll call. What are you staring at, Clifford? The hand. That's one of those spiffy Danish jobbies, isn't it? A flong bar? Buddy, I'll have you know that this beauty was built by Lord Arthur's personal blacksmith back in the 14th century. You know, most people would find that story ludicrous, but that's not even the silliest thing I've heard since lunch. Wait till I tell you about the mini ashes. Fold. Impressive. Nah. -uh. Here's my bet now. So call me maybe. Claptrap has two pair, and the player has a pair of twos. Claptrap wins the hand. That's what you get when you screw with the clap! The tension of all these showdowns is nigh unbearable. I hope it lasts! Apparently, be be weary online tonight. Weary, weary, whatever. Be uh, be be ever alert as the entire episode for Game of Thrones tonight leaked online. Oh, I call. I'm not sure what you're trying to do here, but it's not working. Call. suits you. Do more of it. I'm out. Ash grabs the pot. That was easy. Too easy. You appear to be nodding off. Let's see if moving the blinds up to 600 and 1200 gets your attention. This I can work with. Yeah, I was about to say, you might just want to turn Twitter the fuck off. Is it just me, or is that Samson guy kind of scary? Pretty ironic talk from Mr. Boomstick O Chainsaw, don't you think? No, seriously. Every time he stares at you, it's like there's machetes coming out of his eyes. Poison machetes. With laser beams. I think he's cool. Like Liam Neeson, I'm going to hunt you down and release the Kraken cool. Careful there, silent running. If you start drooling, you might short yourself out. Don't worry, Ash. You'll always be my one true man crush. I'll check that. Check. Not bad. Not really good, but not bad. Call. I call. I'll check. Checko. 
Ah, really? Oh, boys and nuggets. Who dug it? That's a lot of smoke. I'm all in. Great day in the morning. Oh, Sam. Think of all the ham dingers we could buy with that. <laughs> Shh, I'm thinking. I fall. The player has a pair of sixes. And Mr. Williams has a pair of nines. Yeah. <laughs> you probably should have gotten out of that hand. Ash wins the hand. Ha! Nothing can stop me now. <sighs> it appears you have lost all your chips. Oh well. I thought it was a well played hand. You just had the better hand. Right down the drain. You're lucky. If this had been an aperture experiment instead of a poker game, you'd be falling down a bottomless pit right now. Now I just really want to play for tournament. Excellent. If you'll all be so kind, I just really want to play Portal now. And now for your bounty challenge opportunity, Ashley. If you uh, would, maybe. I really hope one of you guys takes this off my hands this time. To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. All right, time to put on our serious faces. We're going for the Necromonicon. Necromonicon. The Necromonicon. Is it? I call. Mm. Way to go out on a limb there, Captain Courageous. Now these cards are making me tingly. Call. Call. Ah, I'm in. I call. Williams always told me to pick my battles carefully, and I'm not picking this one. The player takes the pot. Scared him out of their money. Boogity boogity. I fall. Sam! You got another dog question, don't you? Seriously, can you blame me? How often does a guy get a chance to chat up a talking dog? It's, it's like interviewing a unicorn. Fine. Three questions, but nothing about my privates or floor scooting. Okay, okay. One, can you eat chocolate? Two, do you date humans or other talking dogs? And three, can you sense earthquakes before they happen? One, yes, but I shouldn't, because it goes straight to my hips. Two, don't tell anyone, but I'm kind of off the market right now. And three, dogs don't detect quakes, but sometimes we cause them. Check. I'll bet. Is that a big bet? I've kind of lost track. Nope. Yeah, I'll call. Mr. Williams wins the pot. Groovy.
check. Check. Ooh, impressive. Hmm. That's right. Kind of cold in here. I found that 15 degrees Celsius is the optimum temperature to keep the game moving. In the future, you might want to wear an undershirt. Luckily, I'm already covered in fur. And my tongue's a thermostat. And I have a miniature fusion reactor keeping me warm. Swell. <laughs> Check. Ooh, what now? Whoa. Great day in the morning. I'm out. Hmm. Wendy and I could repair the Oldsmobile with that money. Ah, hell. Let's dive in and see what happens. Shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> ha! The player has Ace High, and Mr. Williams has a pair of tens. Ash wins. Someone get a hose, because I'm on fire, baby. The player has busted out and must leave the table before everyone starts laughing. Ah, oh, man, what's a guy got to do to unload a curse around here? Why don't you get yourself a lemonade while the grown-ups sort this out? Ouch. I've been keeping your seat warm while you've been away. Tonight's tournaments have a $20,000 buy-in. Yeah. And now for another bounty challenge. Ashley? Started strong and then just, like, I really hope one never, of you guys takes this off my hand never met time. that goal again. To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. I'll call. There you go. I'll call that. Hmm. Okay, I'll bet. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. Nope. Oh, boys Whoa, big really? mistake, Jim. You gotta be bluffing, right? Ugh, I think you should know that the Claptrap General Purpose Robot is designed to be completely immune to outrageous bluffing. I'm giddy with anticipation about this call. Looks like I'm all in. So this should be fun. Well, yeah. lost to Ash again. Yes, I did. I'm not proud of what happened. That's the stuff. Mr. Funny Chips has two pair. The player has two pair. And Ash has. A full house. Mr. Williams wins the pot. All right. The player has been eliminated. Ah, oh, man, what's a guy got to do to unload a curse around here? Hey, little buddy, do we have a parting gift for our new friend? Only seething contempt, Sam. Well, that's just swell. If you'll all take your seats, we can get started. As always, the tournament buy-in is $20,000. And now for your bounty challenge opportunity. Ashley, if you would. I really hope one of you guys takes this off my hands this time. 
To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. It's a mathematical certainty that 80% of you are going to lose tonight, and 100% of you will eventually die. Math is fun, don't you think? <laughs> I fall. Let's raise. Jeez, whoever dealt this mess should be shipped off to the Hague. Oh, him. No offense, Sugar Ram. Fold. Fold. Brock. Steals the blinds. Oh, you guys are way too easy. I'll stay in, cause I'm crazy. Bottle fold activated. Yeah, I'm in. Check. You think you've got the cards to take down the king? Well, here's your chance, Mr. Fancy Pants. Who the what now? Just remember, it's only a game. Nope. Smart move. <laughs> oh, man. There it is. <laughs> Mr. Samson has a pair of eights, and Mr. Williams has two pair. Ash wins. Boom. They're just bleeding me on this one. All right, let's go big. Impressive. I call. Fold. Calling. Check. I'll bet. Come on, Brock. Steal your money back. Ah, oh, jeez. Brock Samson has a pair of sevens, and Ash has a pair of twos. Brock wins the hand. I'll just take those. Fine. Five what? Fingers. When you got five of them, I only have four. Yeah, I've been trying not to stare. What's it like having five? Oh, it, uh, it is what it is. The pinky comes in really handy when you're choking someone out. Oh, a maxim like that. So, uh, what's it like with four? Can't complain. Between the fingers and toes, I'm practically built for the computer age. Yeah, how so? We're hexadecimal, baby! I guess you could say for us, the computer age has been a regular digital revolution. Yeah! Don't do that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This <laughs> fucking claptrap.
Great. Ooh, a fall. Snaky. Let's go, Buttercup. Yeah. Ashley has a full house. Brock has a full house. We have a tie, and the pot is split. Wow. That's nuts. Call. Call. I'm in. Is it true that Doc Venture was in a video game back in the 70s? Yeah, uh, back in the cartoon days, someone thought it'd be a good idea to turn Rusty's adventures into a video game. It uh, made that E.T. game look like hate. What about you, big guy? You ever star in a video game? Not, uh, intentionally. A comment that cryptic usually comes with a story. A few years back, some punk snuck my image into a Mortal Kombat knockoff. It's one of those unlockable Easter egg deals. A guy can Mortal pay off Kombat a lot knockoff. of bill collectors hmm. with a stake like the that. Mortal Bobcat! Th that, that was you! What, what, what did they call you? <laughs> Take two, Blondie. <sighs> I'm going all in. Oh, boys and nuggets. All in. Ah, hell. The little robot has two pairs. Sam has a flush. Sam wins. You didn't stand a chance once I decided to win. The robot from Pandora is out of chips. Wow! That was a big ball of suck! I'm off to play a few million hands of video poker. See ya! These lines are too low for players of your artist school. Let's bump them up to 600 and 1200. Puny pile of chips. Have some more. <sighs> huh? I'd buy a lot yeah, of Bowie yeah. knives. Nah. Getting invested, forgetting to talk. I'll fold. It's just a relaxing game of poker. Winning streaks are like dating a beautiful woman. It can Enjoy be them both. while you can, because it's only a matter of time before they dump you for being weird and clingy. You sure you want to keep winning, kid? That Necronomicon ain't no cat in the hat. I don't know. I, uh... I'm all in. Great day in the morning. And this is me folding. Again. Oh, Sam. Think of all the ham dingers we could buy with that. <laughs> Shh, I'm thinking. Call. <laughs> no. Nah.
Brock's taking this one. Oh yeah. Mr. Samson has a pair of kings. Sam has king high. Brock wins. I'll just take the Chainsaw, huh? Isn't that a little messy? It gets the job done. I like my weapons more, uh, intimate. When you're fighting the kind of uglies that I come up against, the last thing you want is intimate. Is bluffing. Maybe they call that a race back in your hometown of Weenieville, but here in Macho Town, we grow our races a smidge bigger than that. Whoa. Mm, great day in the morning. <laughs> no, I do not think Weenus Man is from Weenieville. Old. Who dug it? That's a lot of smoke. All in. Ah, oh, Fuzz Nuggets. I haven't seen a pot that big since the attack of the 50-foot sous chef. Only a fool or a madman would call that bad. Unfortunately for you, my partner is both of those things. I'm also a Pisces. Oh, no. I just need a 10. <laughs> Still use a ten. I think that works. Cool. Or not. The player has a pair of jacks. Mr. Williams has a pair of aces. Sam has a pair of kings. On the side pot, Ash wins the hand. All right. And on the main pot, Mr. Williams wins the pot. The player has been eliminated. Again. Perhaps you should take a break. Ah oh, man, She's what's a guy wrong. gonna do to unload a curse around here? I'm gonna take, take a real quick one to let the dog in. I'll be right back. Try your luck again. The buy in, please.
And now for another bounty challenge. Ashley, if you would. I really hope one of you guys takes this off my hands this time. To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. Are you ready to lose? You should be. I mean, in fairness, my hands have been complete shit all day today. Fool cards like these should be buried in a hole and never spoken of again. Seriously, that's the way you're gonna play. Hmm. I'll raise that. Oh, that's smart. Well, well, well. Really? Call. Spicy. Sure, why not? Drawing him in. Now for the kill. Samson has ace high. The player has a pair of fives. The player wins the hand. Brock Samson has been eliminated. Well, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go blot this evening out of my head with a bucket of Milwaukee's finest. <laughs> Max would love these last few hands. But then again, Max also loves poking himself in the eye with a stick. Hey, Sam! I think I hit brain! <laughs> Raise. I wonder if I can sucker you into betting this much. Huh. All in. Great day in the morning. I'm trying to figure out what you're thinking and it's making my brain hurt. Yeah. Give me that nine. Well, fuck. That's the stuff. The player has a pair of threes, and Mr. Williams has two pair. Ash wins the hand. It's good to be the king. Okay, then. You're more emotional than most of the robots I've met. All CL4PTP general purpose robots are equipped with eighth generation emotive resonators, allowing them to mimic a panoply of human emotions, ranging from sarcastic sympathy to wildly unbridled enthusiasm. So you don't actually feel emotions, you just make them? Um, uh... Don't worry. I'm taking it too. The player takes the pot. I, fall. I didn't think I was just gonna fold on that last ah, one. I figured he'd, he'd go in with me. I call. Rema. Interesting. No, wait, what's the opposite of that? Hmm. Let's prime the pump. I fall. 
Ugh. Folding? But you could have lost so much money. Ash grabs the pot. Don't kick yourself. I would have folded too. But, you know, in a manlier way. What is all this four five hand crap? I'll raise. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. I fold. I don't want it. Damn, G! Look at all that cheddar! Mr. Williams takes the blinds. Looks like the old Williams curse is going the way of the dodo. You appear to be nodding off. Let's see if moving the blinds up to 600 and 1200 gets your attention. <sighs> if I was the kind of guy who used words like jinxed, this is the kind of moment I'd use it. But since you're not that kind of guy, what word are you going to use? Bone? Interesting. No, wait, what's the opposite of that? So, Sam, why don't you take off your jacket? Two reasons. First of all, I paid a team of highly skilled artisans a metric butt ton of money for this new suit. So I'm going to show it off like a trophy wife at a back to school night. And the second reason? Underneath this jacket, I'm sweating like a fat guy in a walk-in humidor. Ugh, thanks for sharing that. Seriously, my pits are so swampy, there are probably manatees swimming around in there. Check it out. Oh. So anyway, I'm keeping it on. Check. Hmm. Best. Ah, nice. oh, hell. Hmm, carry the three. Call in! See what I did there? I'm enjoying all this betting. It means I'll be able to go back to my lab that much sooner. All right, who wants some? Great day in the morning. <laughs> Who's your daddy? Mr. Funny Chips has ace high. The player has a straight, and Ash has a straight. On the side pot, we have a tie, and the pot is split. And on the main pot, we have a tie, and the pot is split. Ugh. Mr. Trap has been eliminated from the tournament. Okay, guess that's it. I'm dead. Hey, where's the regeneration tunnel? We don't do that here. But I can make a whooshing noise if that will make you feel better. Crap. I mean, I'll take the tie. I just, you know, I felt like I had that one. <laughs> I call. I'll call. Is that a big bet? I've kind of lost track. Call. Call? Well, there's a straight. Way to go out on a limb there, Captain Courageous. Call. I could call bets this small until the cows came home. Which makes me wonder why I'd be playing poker in a barn. Check. I call. I'll check. Spicy. What the hell possessed me to stay in this hand? Just remember, it's only a game. I guess I'll call. The 
player has a straight. Sam has a pair of tens. The player wins. Oh, yeah. yeah, anyone could win with those cards. Sam has been eliminated. I knew I shouldn't have listened to Max. Hey, don't drag my fuzzy little butt into your lane cycle. Me and Ash, and I've been struggling against Ash all night. Okay, then. This tournament is giving me an overwhelming sense of deja vu. <laughs> now I remember. It's just like that time my lab rats fought over a piece of cheese. The funny thing is, the rats didn't really need to eat the cheese. They were just conditioned to want the cheese by weeks of electrical stimulation. The player takes the pot. Anyway, in the end they killed each other, and the cheese was eaten by one of the human test subjects. He died too, because the cheese was moldy. You don't know what you're doing, do you? You know, in all the excitement, I've kind of lost track of this hand, so I'm just gonna go all in. Oof. Call, fold, it's all the same to me. Like my chances just went from squat. Thank to you very jack much. Squat. Ash has two pair, and you have a flush. The player wins the hand. Well done. Now we'll see how you do when I'm not stacking the deck in your favor. Pretty sure it's about I time. I've been trying to get rid of that damn book for years. Woot. <laughs> Cthulhu chair! Keeping your seat warm while you've been away. Let the bounty challenges be spun on you. If you'll all be so kind, well, one of them I've already done because it was the portal. Gentlemen and thing. clap trap. Drinks for everyone. Deploy table unlockable from yep, portable. Come second or better right. in consecutive tournaments. Oh god. <laughs> that last one's gonna be a bit of a bitch. Uh, can't even have four drinks for everybody. What's up, Epic? Oh shit. Yeah. 
That's not right at all. Yeah, see, I still don't have the first one. I just have this one. Come on, drop a club. Boo. The little robot has a pair of queens. Mr. Williams has a pair of aces. And the player has ten high ash wins. Groovy. I don't know, I've won on pairs of twos, uh, plenty of times. It appears you have lost all your chips. Oh well, it's only money. Your money. Twenty thousand dollars of it. Right down the drain. Don't worry, it's only money. Oh, that's uh -oh. right, you humans need money, don't you? Always the tournament buy-in is Oh well, it changes the whole room now that the whole set's in play. The name of the game is Texas Hold'em. I'll have to, uh, I didn't realize that. I'll have to try the other sets. Holy crap, I mean, it changed, like, everything. And Sam are the only things unaffected. Brace. I could brazenly bluff my way through this hand, but since I just said that out loud, I think I'll fold instead. And here I thought we were playing a friendly game of high stakes poker. Not this time. And I'm out. Who can get goaded into a horrible decision? All right. Who wants some? Who the what now? <laughs> the cube's falling in the background. Damn. Impressive. I even saw what companion cube. Yeah. Crap. Not, not totally into the music in the background though. Motherfucker. The player has a pair of queens, and Mr. Williams has a straight. Ash wins the hand. Boom. The player has been eliminated due to lack of funds and intelligence. Oh, and here I was just starting to contain my nausea at your hideous visage. Do some venture brothers. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. If you'll all be so kind, oh shit, Brock's shirt's different. Gentlemen and clap track. And helpers heads on the the bar. Mr. Williams has placed the remainder of his chips in the pot, and apparently part of his brain. Hey! Really? Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. 
my fault. I kind of feel like he's, uh... You should know that a Williams never bluffs. He's probably got a flush. Except when we do. <laughs> Let's go, Buttercup. Well, at least we'll get to see what it is. Damn, King! Look at all that cheddar! Fold! There's my five. Nice. I'd have had a fucking Bad straight. A pair of sixes. Mr. Samson has a pair of sevens. Brock wins the hand. Nice. That sucks. I'd have had that one. <laughs> Too risky, though. Ash Williams has been eliminated from the tournament and will be taken from the table by Dr. Venture's experimental teleporter. Teleporter? <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, where's the rest of me? Check it out, Sam. Shoes. Holy crap! It has like all kinds of different interactions if you're playing through the whole set. It's like half the game that I didn't know existed. Hey! I just had a great idea! You should totally ditch those venture losers and bodyguard for me! I think you need a reboot there, Tweaky. That'll be great! You can escort me across the deadly planet of Pandora as I complete my epic quest for power! All in. Ooh, nice. Really? Damn. Oh, boys and nuggets. I go. Oof. You freaking kidding me? Sixes. Uh, oh my god. Triple aces. <sighs> well, I'm out. Come on, come on, baby. Nice. The player has a pair of aces. Brock has three of a kind. Sam has three of a kind. Sam wins with the queen kicker. Never bet against a freelance policeman on the edge of his seat. The player has busted out and must leave the table before everyone starts laughing. Ah, oh, too bad, Junior. Next time, try not to, uh, suck. I'm gonna keep going on the Venture Brothers just so I can see, like... If when you defeat multiple players, it does different things. It's a mathematical certainty that 80% of you are going to lose tonight. And 100% of you will eventually die. Math is fun, don't you think? the importance of a well-timed fold. And then there's you. Uh, talk about a devil's three-way. Right. Nah. Think, think, think. All in. Great day in the morning. Holy hip-hop in Halifax with a side of chili fries. Oh, Sam. Think of all the ham dingers we could buy with that. Thinking. 
Don't. Yea, I say unto thee, they that sow shall reap the mother loving world. I've come back from worse. Seems unlikely, Ash. Oh, Brock's got the finger guns going. Son of a Damn. bitch! Ashley has Damn. a flush. Brock Samson has two pair. Ash wins. Come to daddy. Damn. Brock Samson has been eliminated from the table. I hope Rusty worked out the kinks in this thing. <laughs> Guess not. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> But is it always so quiet in here? The inventory has seen a 23% decline in customers since I was installed as the dealer. I can't imagine why, what with your sunny personality and all. I have several competing hypotheses for this phenomenon, but the most likely one is that the fleeing customers were intimidated by my intelligence. Or maybe they died. That happens a lot when I'm around. Who the what now? Ah, hell. Oh, poison nuggets. Nah. In for a penny, in for a kilogram. <sighs> nice. Kind of thought I was going to be able to bluff it out. I think I fucked myself, though. Queen kicker. You didn't stand a chance once I decided to win. Anyway, have I mentioned how much I love it when you scare the humans? Just remember it's only a game. I call. Would I have gotten two pair Come on, on that? Ash, it's only money. All right. All in. Great day in the morning. I follow. Ash grabs the pot. I could have won. That was a little too easy. Although they were both a little excited about their hands. Okay, got nothing here. like these should be buried in a hole and never spoken of again. Not this time. Mr. Williams takes the blinds. Another pot for me? You shouldn't have. His hands are garbage. Okay, then. This is gonna get ugly, isn't it? Raise. Okay, Claptrap, keep it cool. Don't stare at the money, or it'll think you're a creep. I'm out. Mm, I don't know. Buckle up. It's gonna be a bumpy hand. Yes, it will. <laughs> Not looking great. 
All the heck in. Looking a hell of a lot worse. Nuh uh. Jesus. Ah. I mean, I can still win. Somehow. Yippee. Wasn't with that, the though. Player has a pair of eights. Sam has two pair. Sam wins the hand. Well, the next time you play, you might want to have better cards. The player has been eliminated due to lack of funds and intelligence. Oh, I'm gonna miss you. You are such a good listener. Ready for more, I see. The buy in, please. Are you ready to lose? You should be. Hey, an almost decent hand. tricked out 1960 to sort of adventurer in the parking lot? It better be. I'd hate to think we've been driving around in someone else's car for the past 25 years. Why do you ask? I think it growled at me. Yeah, it's done that ever since that adventure we had in H-E double hockey sticks. Maybe you should see an exorcist. Well, that's what I keep telling Max. But then he just spins his head at me and vomits. And on that track. <laughs> I think even Hank would have folded out of that mess. Claptrap wins. That was like taking candy from a baby. Which on Pandora is really hard, because they're all armed to the teeth that they don't have yet. It appears you have lost all your chips. Oh well, it's only money. Your money. $20,000 of it. Right down the drain. Better luck next time, kid. I'm just really okay, good at poker. Another tournament? Excellent. The buy-in, please. The name Which I guess is a life lesson. Texas I'll stick to blackjack when I go gambling. <laughs> See, like right now, I know to hit in blackjack. I'm out. An easy twenty one. Spicy. I've got a bad feeling about this. And there's just a lot more like nuance and uh, subtle layers to poker. I'll check. Not bad. Not really good, but not bad. Yeah, I'll call. Call. The check is in the mail, and it just arrived, because it was overnight, and sorry, I don't know where I was going with that. Really? Damn. Whoa. Poison nuggets. Mm, I don't know. Duh. Oh, Sam, they 
sick of all the hamdingers we could buy with that. <laughs> Shh, I'm thinking. Hold. The player takes the pot. Hmm, carry the three. has got something. Who dug it? That's a lot of smoke. Wild deadites couldn't keep me out of this party. Is that a robot head over there? <laughs> Super villain a while back. Fortunately, his head got wedged in my chest, protecting his CPU from the force of the blast. For a while, we put the head on top of a giant robot spider we had lying around in the lab, but that kept freaking out Dean, so now Doc's trying to build him a new body. Oh, I'm sorry, were you still talking? I uh, kind of lost track after I imagined a robot head buried in your shirtless torso. Sometimes the best way to stay out of trouble is to run away from it. Wait a minute. This run of crummy cards is just one of your twisted little experiments, isn't it? Maybe. Or maybe you're just too cowardly to turn melons into lemonade. I'm in. Jack? Okay, got up here. Nothing to like write home about, but check please. You might want to pace yourself there. I call. Literally nothing bad can happen if I call. Nothing. Check. I'm gonna check. Good one. It's gotta be bluffing, right? I'll let you guys fight this one out. Damn, G! Look at all that cheddar! Mask. The player takes the pot. You know, Brock, I've been around more than a few mad scientist labs in my time, and I gotta say, this stuff just reeks of failure. Well, yeah, most of Doc's inventions are kind of half-baked. Why doesn't he just shut it down and do something else with his life? Doc's getting a little long in the tooth for a midlife crisis. Besides, there's a part of him that still thinks he can use the super scientist gig to bang supermodels. Is that even a remote possibility? Not really, but don't tell him. He'll probably try to kill himself. A pussy says what? <clears throat> nope. Hold. Sam takes the pot. It's a good thing you all. I love all these obscure venture references. Uh, that uh, that's not a real hand. Not yet. <laughs> Oh, damn. Ladies, ladies, ladies. Interesting. No, wait, what's the opposite of that? All this folding is making me a little pent up. I fold! Ah, I'm in. I didn't really look at my cards, but I'm calling anyway. <laughs> You got nothing oh, to be worried about, Ash. 
You're there. Nope. There you go. Well, I'll just call it nonsense. Damn. I'm toast, aren't I? The player has Booyaka the Jaw. And Ash has a pair of tens. The player wins. Not bad, Spanky. Mr. Williams has been eliminated. You guys are all ringers, aren't you? Get your teleporting ass out of here. The uh, blind doesn't always do it. And I fall into a coma. Hold on, I gotta finish my tweet. You're tweeting the tournament. Tweeting, live blogging, thought spamming, hashtag clap trap kicks butt in the his house. Isn't it kind of hard to play poker and uh, twerp at the same time? I think you're seriously overestimating the quality of my tweets. Brock steals the plot. But for the record. Game is light years ahead of itself. This is before tweeting was like. If I'd wanted as big to as play it garbage is. at me all night, I could have stayed home watching C-SPAN. Oh yeah, and I definitely made the right decision. Call. Call. of probability and common sense but you're special oh. all right that's it i'm flipping a virtual coin to make my decision Ugh! how's a virtual coin laying on its side i'll call that Mr. Trap has three of a kind, and you have two pair. Clap Trap wins the pot. It was secretly a ruse all along! I do know what I'm doing! As soon as I saw that three, I was like, well, balls. Dude, these hands are garbage. Sure, why not? I call. Since we're just oozing with confidence, I'll check too. Well, that. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. All right, time to separate the cottons from the lacy unmentionables. Big mistake, Junior. Interesting fold. And by a lot of Bowie. getting ugly. Ooh, three of a kind. Yeah, figured he had an ace. Dum dum da dum dum da dum da dum me dum. No. 
Mr. Funny Chips had two pair. Mr. Samson had three of a kind. Sam had two pair. On the side part, Claptrap wins the hand. And on the main part, Mr. Samson wins the pot. It's no shame in losing to a superior opponent. Sam has been eliminated and will be teleported to a better place. I hope it's Tahiti. It's not. Is it me or does this teleporter make my keister look fat? See, now we just got to see what the teleporter does to Claptrap. So, what are you? Sort of helper robot. Oh, the CL4PTP is so much more than a mere helper. We're companions, guides, teachers, comrades in arms. Forget I asked. I can do that too, see? Whoa, accidentally erased my bar mitzvah there. Looks like someone's overcompensating for something. Not this time. I think you should know that the Claptrap General Purpose Robot is designed to be completely immune to outrageous bluffing. Looks like you backed poor old Claptrap into a corner. Call. Oh yeah! Claptrap has a flush. The player has a pair of nines. Claptrap wins. If this keeps up, I may have to upgrade my chassis to store all my money. Thank you. Jack. Well, that's unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Mr. Trap has two pair. Rock Samson has a pair of twos. And our silent friend has two pair. On the side part, Clap Trap wins the pot. And on the main part, the player wins the hand. The blinds have been increased to 800 and 1600. the 
this raw for room carpet. He's bluffing. But I don't have anything either. Well, that was a clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. Eh, he wasn't bluffing. Oh, yeah. Brock has three of a kind, and the player has a pair of aces. Wait a minute! Are we suddenly playing high-low here? Negative. Then why did Spanky McSucky cards even stay in the hand? Brock wins. That's an excellent question. Cool. Alright, I gotta take a, a break mid-tournament. I'll be right back. I'm back. Just gotta pour a beer. Hey, look, another shit hand. Sorry, mid pour. Uno momento. Gotta go with that. If I had my webcam on, I'd, I'd actually show you guys. I, I take great pride in pouring, pouring my beer. Just want a tiny bit ahead. because you're too embarrassed to admit that you've forgotten the rules. Just nod your head. I promise not to tell anyone. Uh-uh. Claptrap steals the pot. 
So that's what you humans call bluffing. Seriously, I had nothing. I had the weirdest dream last night. Did it involve Charles Manson, Rita Moreno, and a duck? No, but... Then it wasn't the weirdest dream. You might want to pace yourself there. Call. Ecce, Uther's leg. player takes the pot. The blinds are now set at 1,000 and 2,000. Nice round number. Seals the pot. That's right. You better run. So, anyhow, like Ooh, I was saying, noise. if you're running on fusion, then why am I smelling diesel fumes? Oh, that! That's my aftershave. Nothing drives the lady robots crazy like a few dabs of burning hydrocarbons behind the audio sensors. Oh, yeah. I'm going all in. Big mistake, Junior. Go on with your bad self. Yeah. <sighs> 
A pair of aces. And our silent friend has a pair of eights. Just sure you know what you're doing there, Stiff. Because uh, that hand was not good. Claptrap wins the hand. The only thing better than winning is winning again. Anyhow, it's true. It's driving me insane. Just like Lizzie Borden. Check. Have some cheese, rat. of all poker moves are check. It's not an interesting statistic, but neither was your check. Oh, damn it, all in. Really? The look in your eyes says I've got you by the balls. He probably does have you by the balls. But I'm gonna call it. Yep, uh, he's got my queen. And there's death. The player has two pair. Brock Samson has two pair. Brock wins with the higher pairs. I'll just take that. Charles Manson, Rita Moreno, and a duck? No, but... Then it wasn't the weirdest dream. Claptrap steals the pot. Thanks for the free money, everybody! I'd probably be more offended if I paid the slightest attention to anything you said. I'll call that. Oh, oh, here's an idea. Why don't we put some actual money in this pot? Oh. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it when things end prematurely. Mr. Trap has a pair of sixes, and the player has a full house. The player wins. You know what they say lucky in cards, unlucky in love. Oh wait, that's a bad thing, isn't it? The blinds have been increased to 264 and 4C8 in base 23. Thank you, thank you. I'll give you a minute to work that out before I deal the next hand. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. might want to pace yourself. There you go. I've got a bad feeling about this. I'll check. 
I checked. Don't feel bad. If I had your brain, I'd fold too. Uh, check. I'll bet this much. I'm out. Claptrap steals the pot. Am I really that scary? It's kind of worrying me. With his arms out of his sockets. All in. Yeah. Big mistake, Jim. Yeah, that Damn was it. probably the right move. Clap trap steals the pot. There must be a glitch in the matrix. little robot has ace high the player has king high that trap wins with an ace kicker you thought i was bluffing sucks to be you the player has been eliminated as a consolation prize for not completely humiliating yourself in tonight's tournament the owner has asked me to give you these complimentary inventory tokens you're not a crier are you Cause I got serious rust issues with criers. Keeping your seat warm while you get away. Tonight's tournaments have a twenty thousand dollar buy-in. Hey, where'd my money go? To a pleasant upstate farm where it has room to play with all its currency friends. Call. Call. 
Yeah, I know. I try not to look at how far I'm down. I want to say that, like, I was a couple million up in my other original run of this game, like, a couple years ago, so I don't know if I just play a little bit looser now, or if uh, I played just generally better or longer then. I'm not really sure. Okay, then. I call. Calling? Yeah, I'll call. But given the state that uh, Telltale is in, like, I totally think that they might come knocking on my door for 2,000 fake dollars. Interesting. No, wait, what's the opposite And they can get in fucking line behind everybody else. Right. Not this time. I'll hold. Well, that was a clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. I'm all fucking in. Off, boys and nuggets. Go ahead and call. I dare you. Really? Ah, hell. Ooh. Great day in the morning. Nice. Ace high. Booyah! Or double aces with a king kicker. Either way, not great. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The player has a pair of fives. Brock has a pair of aces. Ooh, that's... Not good. Brock wins the hand. Well, that's pretty much how I figured it'd go down. Now 220 in the hole. The player has been eliminated. Again. Perhaps you should take a break. I'll miss you. At least I think I will. I won't know until you actually leave. So go. Now. As always, the tournament buy-in is twenty thousand dollars. I call. I mean, that sets me up for a possible flush or straight, so you know, it's pretty nice. Seriously, that's the way you're gonna play. Not this time. I call. I. I call. And I'm looking at a possible street. Are soon parted. Fool me twice. Well, we won't get fooled again. I call. That was evil, and I know a little something about evil. Think, think, think. Calling. You know, after all this time, I'm still not sure what a dead eye really is. Well, it all starts with a demonic book that should never, ever be read out loud. All in. Big mistake, Junior. Damn. <coughs> ah, hell. Yeah. I think one of you has taken leave of his senses. More so than usual, though. Call in! See what I did there? I think he's got the higher. No, he didn't have a seven. Dang. Dude. Mr. Funny Chips Booyah. has a pair of sixes. The player has a straight. Sam has a straight. The player wins with the high straight. Laugh it up while you can, fussball. That's the kind of loss that'll linger for weeks. Or until Max does something funny. Right. Where were we? Claptrap has been eliminated and will be textualized. Textualized? Claptrap Babushka Nito! Oh, come on! That's not even close! <laughs> Shit. 
Sam got off light. Nope. Check. <laughs> you might want to pace yourself. Whoa! Are you sure you want to make a bet that big? Damn, Brock, calm down. Spicy. I'm in. I need to run for the hills. Huh. Brock steals the plot. Uh, for the record, that was a bluff. I call. I'll check. 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 Spicy. So, Samson, you work for that Doc Venture egghead, right? Well, it's a little more complicated than that, but, uh, I'm his bodyguard. So why isn't he at the table tonight? You know, with his massive brain and all. I'm... all in. <laughs> Damn. Man, yeah, why not? What do I have to lose at this point? Yeah. Who's your daddy? Ash has two pair, and you have ace high. Mr. Williams wins the pot. It's good to be the king. Well, anyhow, well, a big part of my job is screening Doc Ventures mail for dangerous items. Anthrax, bombs, financial scams, that sort of thing. <laughs> Mm, two pair. Well, not really. I just know better than to let Rusty anywhere near a poker table. What, he can't bluff? Are you kidding? Doc lies like a rug, but he's just not so good with numbers and probability and stuff like that. The player takes the pot. So anyway, just like Einstein. Sure. Ah, uh, welcome to the party, kid. What would Bonham do? Raise. Yeah. Seriously, that's the way you're gonna play. Call. Not bad. Uh uh. The player takes the pot. These blinds are too low for players of your obvious skill. Let's bump them up to 600 and 1200. Let's raise. Nice. I'd buy a lot of Bowie knives. Oh, jeez. I'll win. Ah, hell. All in. Damn. 
trying to read my face for tells, huh? Yeah, they good luck it. with that. I've taken so many blows to the head that the muscles in my face twitch. At least one of them will get eliminated. See? Bye, Brock. Mr. Samson has a pair of jacks, and Mr. Williams has a pair of jacks. Ash wins with the ten kicker. All right. Brock Samson has been eliminated. Wow, I uh, really didn't see this coming. I did, but I didn't want to ruin the surprise. Surprise. So now I'm in second place, so that means I've got to get another tournament in second or first place consecutively. Whoa, those other jokers have a hot date or something? And with hands like these, it's not looking great. There's something I don't get about this whole tournament. I can tell from the way you're playing. No, I mean, what's in it for the inventory? They're not taking a cut of the buy-in, so why go through all the trouble to set up these tournaments? Allow me to browse their business plan. Mm, it appears that the inventory makes its money by streaming poker tournaments on the internet for the amusement of the masses. I guess the owner thought the four of you would be amusing, which, when you think of it, is rather amusing. In a metatextual kind of way. The player takes the pot. Check. Mm. Hmm, what would Chuck Finley do? I'll keep this friendly. Player takes the pot. Let's raise. Okay, then. Yeah, I'm in. Way to go out on a limb there, Captain Courageous. Call. Well, hello, Mr. Fancy Pants. Hmm. Wendy and I could repair the Oldsmobile with that money. You think you've got the cards to take down the king? Well, here's your chance, Mr. Fancy Pants. Impressive. Mr. Williams has ace high, and the player has two pair. The player wins the hand. The player has Damn won right. the tournament, rescuing Arthur's kingdom from the armies of darkness. As a reward for your service, you will be given this potion, three sips of which will put you into a magical slumber until you reawaken in time for the next tournament. Was that two sips? <laughs>
told you these phony beards were a bad idea. There he is. your seat we can get started if you'll all be so kind as to empty up I like the uh kind of film noir filter let's make this quick i have experiments to supervise i fall Taking candy from a baby. Fear the brain, Samson. I'll raise that. Change up. Huh? That little message. It gets the job done. I like my weapon. When you're fighting the kind of uglies that I come up against, the last thing you want is intimate. That's a, uh, that's a pretty healthy smile. But you want this bomb? Go ahead. Take it from me. Whoa. <laughs> Who does <that> have a lot of Drop the four. No oh, wait, the four's not gonna save me. <laughs> well, drop the four anyway. The oh shit, the four did save Rock me. Has a pair of tools. The player has a straight and ash. Okay, has yeah, okay. I thought I had a straight going. On the side path, I just lost it for a second. Wins. And on the main path, the player wins the hand. Nice job keeping victory squarely in the jaw of victory. Brock Samson is eliminated. Geronimo! drinks but like cool. Brock's already been eliminated so I'm gonna remind me to buy everybody drinks next tournament when I inevitably lose this one Check. folding suits you do more of it Ooh, triple kings. Right. For me, I mean. Wait, did I just lose there? Yes. Ashley has a pair of kings. 
Sam has three of a kind. Sam takes the pot. You didn't stand a chance once I decided to win. Ashley Williams has been eliminated. Ouch. Wendy is gonna kill me. Well, not literally. At least I hope not. I don't really have a good track record on that front. Am I eating crazy chips, or did you used to have a different voice? Oh, you mean more like this? Hello! That's it! What happened to it? Criminals used to laugh at me. They said my voice was too goofy, so I got a voice coach. And now, when I say freeze, dirtbags, the dirtbags really freeze. Okay, but what's his excuse? Uh, Max just fell in love with his Jason Alexander impersonation one day, and it kind of stuck. Considering the alternatives, I kind of dodged a bullet there. And hey, what is the deal with antipasta? Does it blow up when it touches regular pasta? I mean, come on! No sense rocking the boat now. I'll call. I'm gonna check. Check. Check a Rudy. I'll check. Dingers, we could buy with that. <laughs> Shh, I'm thinking. I fold. Claptrap steals the pot. Well, that was easy. The blinds are now six hundred and twelve hundred. <laughs> Call. Hmm. I'll call that. Have you been merchandised yet, Claptrap? Have I been merchandised? Bumala! My image is plastered on so much crap that even I'm getting sick of it. Coffee mugs, t-shirts, feminine hygiene products, and that's not even counting the 43 different action figures. Action figures? Oh, yeah. You want one? Yeah. Not for me, of course. It's for my, uh, friend, Max. Don't go dragging me into your arrested adolescence. Tell you what, meet me behind the inventory after the tournament, and I'll set your friend up with a rare mid-condition worm-dancing claptrap. Yes! Uh, I mean, I'm sure Max will be very happy. <sighs> I thought you all in. Great day in the morning. This is the part of the tournament where I taunt you mercilessly until you call. Would you prefer to be compared to a chicken, the female reproductive system, or the French? The French. Hey! A good thing! King me. Claptrap has a flush, and our silent friend has a pair of jacks. Is staying in a hand with worthless cards some sort of primitive earth custom? Claptrap wins the pot. Again? You shouldn't have.
think you should know that the Claptrap General Purpose Robot is designed to be completely immune to outrageous bluffing. Cool! <laughs> If I were you, I'd take that as a direct challenge to my, um, personhood. I wonder how many chips I could buy with those chips. I'm going all in, just like mm. I was with your mama last night. Turns out she's a really good poker player. Oh, boys and nuggets. This is just like watching armadillos roll into each other to please the comely armadillo queen. Mm. Looks like O'Clappy's just bought himself a big old sack of pain. Oh, so I might pull it out with the flush. Oh, thank you. Rats. Mr. Trap has a pair of twos. The player has two pair. Sam has ace high. On the side pot, the player wins. Yes. And on the main pot, the player wins the hand. The winner of tonight's Sam and Max 25th Anniversary Tournament is none other than the player! My hero! Knock it off, Max. You don't even like uh, whatever gender that is. Call me. <laughs> I have all the unlocks. Cthulhu Chair! Hey, let's see what the Borderlands set gets us. Ooh, more, ooh, more, I see. Good claptrap. All fancy and shit. As always, the tournament buy in is $20,000. Oh, yes, thank you, Kara. Jesus. Good call. Fold. Yeah, I'll call. I want to see what happens when these cards get together with their royal buddies. You completed another set of bounty challenges. Is that a big bet? I've kind of lost track. Call. I call. <laughs> Checo Rema. Well. All in, baby. Great day in the morning. Just remember, it's only a game. I fold. Interesting fold. Ash grabs the pot. I was probably bluffing that time, but thanks for playing along. I still love Moxie's outfit. I totally want to cosplay that one year. Life on Pandora seems a little gut-centric. You know it, baby. According to our resident gunologist, there are over 200 gajillion different kinds of guns on Pandora. There's no such thing as a gunologist or a gajillion. Maybe not on Earth, but on Pandora, we've got so many guns, we have to make up new words just to describe them. But <laughs> doesn't anybody fight up close and personal? Only when they run out of ammo. Knives and clubs are for cavemen and losers. Present company accepted, big guy. Nah. This is too confusing for a simple guy like me. Well, if I were you, I'd probably be peeing in my pants. Rob steals the pot. Yeah, that was probably the right. What is with these hands? 
Yeah, I'm in. I like these cards. Not like like. That'd be weird. Spicy. I think I'll stay out of this one. I'll call. Damn. Who the what now? Ah, oh, hell. Like it. Call. I'll fold. Max. That's right! Fold. Yet. <laughs> yeah. Come on, come on, baby. Nice. Mr. Samson has a straight, and you have yeah. a pair of threes. Well, you got more guts than brains there, mister. Rock wins. Let's see if we can keep this gravy train rolling. The player has busted out and must leave the table before everyone starts laughing. Why don't you get yourself a lemonade while the grown ups sort this out? If you'll all be so kind as to empty up. And now for your bounty challenge opportunity. Well, this is embarrassing. You've completed a slate of our most grueling bounty challenges, but we appear to have run out of bounty items. <laughs> the tournament is being controlled by aliens. Pay no attention to that. Ah, a rare Gladys personality core. A fitting bounty indeed. No, it's really not. Trust no one. Whoever wins the tournament will take the core as a prize to claim the bounty. All you have to do is win the tournament. Let's do this with this amazing hand. I call slash S. Not bad. Not really good, but not bad. Sure, why not? I call. Wild deadites couldn't keep me out of this party. I'll call. Check. Check. I'll check. Hey! No fair overflowing my register like that! Uh-uh. Alright, one second. I'll be right back. Fold. So, Sam, when can I expect to enjoy the next thrilling multi chapter adventure of the Freelance Police? Fudge. All in. Who the what now? Impressive. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I mean, yes. The player has a pair of queens. Sam has two pair. Sam wins. Come to Papa, little chips. Don't anthropomorphize the money, Max. I mean, Sam. The player has been eliminated. You can't send me back. She's planning things, man. Big things. Oh, stop. Oh, no, it's all true. Even the car.
It's all good. Thanks for stopping in, Kara. Appreciate you hanging out with me today. I'll miss Get you, some kid. sleep. You look quiet. I like that. Ready to try your luck again? Tonight's tournaments have a twenty thousand dollar buy-in. And now for another bounty challenge. Gladys, please place your bounty on the table. I don't see why everyone's so interested. I'm out. To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. Folding because you're too embarrassed to admit that you've forgotten the rules. Just nod your head. I promise not to tell anyone. I don't know. Ah, oh, damn it, Owen. Ah, hell. Be gentle. Massachusetts. All righty. Brock Samson has a pair of aces. Sam has two pair. Sam wins the hand. Hey, I won. Neat. Brock Samson has been eliminated. Whoa, now. Yes, damn. <laughs> in my sandwiches. Okay, then. The player takes the pot. Do, 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 do. I pray. Mm, I don't know. All right. Who wants some? Really? a clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. I'm all in. Great day in the morning. Ooh, this is not going to end well. Ooh, shit. I've come back from worse. Drop a king, king me. Yeah. 
Mr. Funny Chips has a pair of aces. The player has a pair of kings. And Mr. Williams has a pair of jacks. On the side pot, Claptrap wins. And on the main pot, Claptrap wins the pot. Woo! That's gonna hurt! It does. Mr. Williams has been eliminated. Well then, guess it's time to slam down a few beers and dream up an excuse for losing all that money. Call. <laughs> Whose bright idea was it to give me one of those stupid fuzzy logic circuits? I raise. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. Call. <laughs> I bet. Fold. Claptrap steals the pot. Wow! Looks like I'm stuck in a loop! A sexy winning loop! Interesting. No, wait, what's the opposite of that? You know what really ticks me off? When some jackpot tries to blow my circuitry with some lame old stunt he saw in a Star Trek rerun. What? Like, everything I say is a lie? Yeah, like that! What? Do they think I'll just lock up because of some teeny tiny logical paradox? All in. Ah, oh, fuzz nuggets. Great day in the morning. Good what now? Show me the money. No, wait. First the card, then the money. Yes. There is no robot god. The little robot has. A pair of twos. The player has a straight. The player wins. What's this emotion I'm feeling? It's like I wish I had those cards, but I also hate you for having them. That's envy, you emotionally stunted rhomboid. And now I'm learning arousal. <laughs> you appear to be nodding off. Let's see if moving the blinds up to 600 and 1200 gets your attention. Anyway, it is rather insulting. I learned how to avoid paradox traps while I was still in beta. So what if everything Sam says is a lie? That doesn't mean that he's lying about that, right? Because then he'd be telling the truth. And, uh... Oh, oh no. Jesus. Well, that was a shining moment in the history of robot kind. And I'm back! Call. LOL cats are being used by the Illuminati to communicate via steganography. I'll call that. I didn't really look at my cards, but I'm calling anyway. Checko. Big bet? I've kind of lost track. This hand has been brought to you by the letters W, T, and F. Nope. The player takes the pot. I think I'll call. Really? So, on Pandora, you can get guns and vending machines? Guns, ammo, med kits, you name it, we vend it. What about candy bars? I'm going all in. Ah, oh, fuzz nuggets. Great day in the morning. Wait a minute, weep. Seriously, your tears nourish me. 
I thought he was bluffing. Flush. Don't poop. Claptrap has to pair, and our silent friend has a flush. The player wins the hand. That's a relief. I was worried you might screw that up again. So, like I was saying, candy bars? What kind of monster would sell candy bars at vending machines where innocent kids could get their hands on them? Huh, let's go all in. Oh, boys and nuggets. I call. Don't mind me. I'm just reeling you in like a marlin. A big, stupid marlin. Great poker face there, Sam. Oh, yeah. Are you sure about that? had a better hand than that. <laughs> ah. Mr. Trap has ace high. Sam has a pair of kings. Sam wins. Never bet against a freelance policeman on the edge of his seat. The robot from Pandora is out of chips. Crap trap out! Call? Today the pizza boy came to my door, but I hadn't ordered any pizza, so now I have to move. I like the cut of these cards, Jim. I'm in. I didn't realize cards had jibs. Or that you could cut them. <laughs> oh, Sam. Think of all the ham dingers we could buy with that. <laughs> Shh, I'm thinking. I fold. The player takes the pot. Looks like it's just you and me. I hope you brought some antibiotics, because this is going to sting. Check. I'll check. Not bad. Not really good, but not bad. I call. He has anything either, though. Hmm. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. Nope. The player takes the pot. I enjoy these little games. I enjoy them even more when they're bigger. The blinds are now 800 and 1600. You remind me of someone. Everyone reminds you of someone, Sam. That's it. You remind me of everyone. And no one. Weird. Interesting. No, wait. What's the opposite of that? Call. takes the pot. High hand at least. Hmm. I think I'll call. Uh, oh 
Okay, I'll bet. You don't know what you're doing, do you? I'm not just all in. I'm all caps in. Is that a good idea? Because honestly, I don't really know what I'm doing. Well, that's good, right? For me, I mean. Need a ten. And I lost. Oh, yeah. Sam has three of a kind, and the player has a pair of eights. Sam takes the pot. More chips for me? I don't know what to say. Try your booty, Sam. Sorry, one second. I gotta let the dogs in. Clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. Just remember, it's only a game. I'll call. Great day in the morning. Rats, it's yours. Woof! Way to undermine my confidence, little buddy. The player takes the pot. I have go kits assembled for 18 different end of the world scenarios. Is that a big bet? I've kind of lost track. I call. I'll check. Interesting. No, wait, what's the opposite of that? I fall. The player takes the pot. Call? Do you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking that I should put the two of you in a cryogenic game so that I can replay this tournament over and over at my leisure. But that would be wrong. Hey, I thought we were friends. It's playing computer poker by itself, Sam. It doesn't have friends. <sighs> All the heck in. Sam takes the pot. The next time you play, you might want to have better cards. At the turn, the blinds will now be 1,000 and 2,000. Not bad. Not really good, but not bad. I'll call. This may look like a small bet, but just wait until it metastasizes. Well, dang. Yeah. All in. Massachusetts. Sam has two pair. The player has two pair. Sam wins with the higher pairs. 
Is this what good luck feels like? Sam wins the tournament and the hearts of millions. You can't send me back. She's planning things, man. Big things. Oh, stop. Oh, no, it's all true. Even the guy. <laughs> For another tournament? Excellent. The buy in, please. And now for your bounty challenge opportunity. Gladys, please place your bounty on the table. I don't see why everyone's so interested. I'm out. To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. <laughs> Whether your re-raise indicates a lack of poker skill or a lack of manners. To be fair, it could easily be both. Uh. And I'm out. Hmm. Wendy and I could repair the Oldsmobile with that money. I'm all in. Oh, boys and nuggets. Fold. Impressive. Yeah. Player has two pair and Ash has two pair. Ash wins with the higher pairs. Groovy. The player has been eliminated due to lack of funds and intelligence. You can't send me back. She's planning things, man. Big things. Oh, stop. Oh, no, it's all true. Even the car. <laughs> Whew, that's a relief. The way those eyes kept staring at us all the time. Ooh. As always, the tournament buy-in is 20,000. Oh wow, my mic's been off. Hopefully you guys could hear me anyway. And now for another bounty challenge. Gladys, please place your bounty on the table. It's got a physical button and a software button, and if both are not off, then you guys can usually hear me, but, yeah. Embarrassing. It's, it's been on mute for, like, 20 minutes now. Just a goofy talking dog. What would I know about combinatorial game theory, multivariant conditional probabilities, or all if numbers? I'm always talking to myself. So sometimes you guys respond. Uh, I don't like bluffing. So. Okay, claptrap, keep it cool. Don't stare at the money, or it'll think you're a creep. Nah. It could potentially be a straight or a flush. All in. It's unlikely, but it's possible. Nice. Damn. Impressive. Day in the morning. Damn it with the double aces again. Ah. And now he's got trip aces. And that's a loss. Nice. Ah, 
the player has okay the pair of one hands. more tourney Sam since I keep losing on the first hand no offense but are you sure you know how this game works Sam wins the hand well, the next time you play you might want to have better cards it appears you have lost all your chips oh well it's only money your money Oh, yeah, I guess you didn't hear my answer. It's called uh, Poker Nights 2 at the Inventory. Things, it's from Telltale Games. Oh, no, it's all true, even the Perhaps you can try again later, after you've upgraded your brain. If you'll all take your seats, we can get started. If you'll all be so kind as to empty up. And now for your bounty challenge opportunity. Let us please place your bounty on the table. I don't see why um, so I don't know that I ever put it out on mobile. It, I mean, it came out uh, several years ago, and it used to be on Steam, and it's not anymore. I think it's through one of the brand stores. I don't remember which one. Yeah, this is like my favorite poker poker game. Although I prefer uh, I prefer blackjack. I'll check that. Hmm. Okay, I'll bet. <laughs> I don't get angry. I'm, I'm not familiar what's uh six feet of chips what's w sop nope rock steals the pot fears a bitch isn't it? oh world series of poker I don't honestly watch like I've, I've, I've tuned in a few times just because I'm curious to see how people play each other because I think that's really what poker really comes down to. Uh, most of it has to do with the luck of the draw, but like the real key of it is is how well you can play your opponent. I've kind of lost track. Guys, guys, guys! Are you stuck in a loop again? No! I just realized that the four of us represent the four pillars of geek media! Movies, television, and comics! Honestly, I kind of wish they would ban uh, sunglasses or any other facial obstructions uh, during like World Series play. I think watching eye movements and twitches around the eyes is is vital, and anybody that can wear like dark shaded sunglasses is I mean that's kind of an upper hand kind of thing. An MGM promised to cross me over with James Bond someday. Besides, I thought you liked working for. Uh, Shoebox? Gearbox? Those do Let me tell you something. Gearbox is the best video game company in the world, bar none. They treat their employees with dignity, respect, and, yes, love. Also, I am a total tool. With the rusty sound fork, know what I mean? Back. Calling? I don't. <laughs> Check. I'll bet. If you wake up suddenly in the middle of the night, look outside for an unmarked white van. There's probably been a shift change. Uh, I haven't seen a river that full of shit since the Mekon and Delta. I'm out. Hmm. Call. A little robot has a pair of tools. And Mr. Williams has a pair of tools. Fat Trap wins with an ace kicker. You thought I was bluffing? Sucks to be you! on 
Pandora seems a little gun centric. You know it, baby. According to our resident gunologist, there are over 200 scajillion different kinds of guns on Pandora. There's no such thing as a gunologist or a scajillion. Maybe not on Earth, but on Pandora, we've got so many guns, we have to make up new words just to describe them. But doesn't anybody fight up close and personal? Only when they run out of ammo. Knives and clubs are for cavemen and losers. Brock Sampson. Or, or are you sticking with your, uh, your original answer of Brick Samson? <laughs> I'm fine with either. I'm just wondering. All in. Really? Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. I follow. Call. Fold. It's all the same to me. Brock's the man. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> Son of a... The player has a pair of eights, and Ash has a pair of eights. The player wins with the queen kicker. Ash has been eliminated, or at least he's about to be. <laughs> you know, you could have just asked me to leave. Oh, Dr. Killinger? Oh yeah, man. I love me some Dr. Kellinger. Adventure Brothers is probably one of my all-time favorites. Right, exactly. So, on Pandora, you can get guns and vending machines? Guns, ammo, med kits, you name it, we vend it. What about candy bars? Candy bars? What kind of monster would sell candy bars at vending machines where innocent kids could get their hands on them? But here on Earth... Yeah, here on Earth, you've got an obesity epidemic, people. But on Pandora, our children are healthy, lean fighting machines. So suck it! The player takes the pot. No, but he's more based on uh, the over-the-top nature of Doctor Strange in the Marvel comics. Hmm. I feel lucky. What about you, Buck? I'll call. <laughs> What's that? Hmm, carry the three. Call. Cripes, this is more complicated than that double date with the Siamese triplets. I call. See, I, th I want to say that I did read the Marvel Zombies run, but um, I don't remember it being by Kirkman, because obviously I know Kirkman from uh, Battle Pope and, uh, of course, the big one, the, the Walking Dead, but I had no idea that he did the uh, the zombie run from Marvel. That's the way you're going to play. Mr. Samson has a pair of queens, and you have a pair of aces. The player wins 
What's this emotion I'm feeling? It's like I wish I had those cards, but I also hate you for having them. That's NBU emotion. Oh, nice. See, I, I feel like I read it, but like, I don't know, like the. the I feel like when I read it, I thought it was done, but then they put out more. But I could be misremembering. You know, my mom warned me against playing poker with dogs, robots, cripples, and mutes. Guess I should have listened to her. These lines are turned off for players of your obvious skill. Let's bump them up to 600 and 1200. I do strongly recommend uh, Kirkman's uh, Battle Pope. Question, I never you? finished it. It was his Seriously, first comic. Uh, it's fucking hilarious. Fine. Three questions, but nothing about my privates or floor scooting. Okay, okay. One, can you eat chocolate? Two, do you date humans or other talking dogs? And three, can you sense earthquakes before they happen? Oh, nice. Yeah, see, I've always been into Marvel anyway, so... Who the what now? You can't spell fold without fold. Sam takes the bar. Don't be discouraged. Running in fear is a pretty natural response to a six-foot-tall dog with a gun. Anyway. One, yes, but I shouldn't, because it goes straight to my hips. Two, don't tell anyone, but I'm kind of off the market right now. And three, dogs don't detect quakes, but sometimes we cause them. If I ever start acting weird, ask me to do this handshake. If I can't, then I'm a clone. Uh, you know, doing pretty good. Damn. Uh, just ran out of beer, so I'm about to, to dip back into my bourbon. <laughs> uh, about to try and go on a summer diet. Uh, starting tomorrow, so killing all the alcohol in the house today. Like a true alcoholic. How about you? How you doing? Flop. Oh, I call. Hmm. Fudge. All in. Really? Big move, man. No, no, not real money. Good God, if I had this kind of money to piss away on Sunday afternoon poker <laughs> with uh, fictional characters, ugh, yeah, no, uh, things would be much different, I'll put it that way. Player wins the hand. Sam has been eliminated. And I can't believe we got all dolled up for nothing. Speak for yourself, Sam. I've made a couple hundred bucks cleaning out the beer gutters. Whee! Two men enter. <laughs> One robot leaves. <laughs> Charlie, if I was that well off, man, I, I'd be my own best da damn friend. Call. Right now, I don't want anything to do with me. Hangover soup. <laughs> I didn't get that drunk last night, so I actually woke up fine. What kind of hangover soup do you go with? Let's 
See if I can suck you in with a bet that doesn't trigger your primitive flight reflex. Oh, wait, did I say that out loud? No idea what moose mat soup is. <laughs> okay, meat sounds a little bit better. I still, I mean, I get the under, uh, you know, the underlying premise of moose meat soup or moose meat soup, but I've never had it. I'm not sure that I've ever had moose. I'm Cajun, so I've had much of everything, but uh, moose is a, a northern meat, like way north. So I don't know that I've had it. Victory is so close now for one of you. You don't know what you're doing, do you? Hmm. I'm all in. The Canadian government has been in clandestine talks with the Bigfoot Nation since 1972. Ah, Skagflap! Oh man, I love me some crawfish. They're like my favorite sea bug. Kill it with fire! Mr. Funny Chips has to a pair, and you have to a pair. The player wins with a nine picker. Oh no, it's the puppet master. I know too much. Congratulations, you won. I hope you weren't expecting baked desserts, because I don't do that anymore. Take me now before she uses her mind bullet. Oh yeah, no, they're definitely all sea bugs. I just don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I'll eat those little fuckers all day long. Little Tony Saturies, boil them. You know, uh, if you've got any uh, crab boil, toss that shit in there with some uh, mushroom salt. Boom, perfect. Minus minus lobsters, obviously. Lobsters you're gonna want to do a little bit differently, but crab, shrimp, um, crawfish. Yeah, all good there. And then, of course, you know, throw in some, some diced potatoes to soak up those seasonings. And then you pour it all in a bucket and then you spill it out on the table, lined in newspaper, because that's how it's done. I don't know why it's done that way, but that's how it's done. I'm not sure what Akadin is. I'm Cajun. I see. No, I'm actually Cajun. Uh, I'm from the South. I just also like lobster. I don't speak with a Southern accent, though. It's taken me years to <laughs> try and and uh, beat that out of my uh, um. I don't know speech pattern, whatever. I don't no, I don't I don't actually speak uh fluent Cajun at all. I I can understand it verbally uh to a degree, but I can't speak it. Same with French for that matter.
the song. I'm not familiar. I'm looking it up. Bruce Springsteen. I have a hard time believing. Okay, well, I guess it's it's accredited as being the the traditional Cajun waltz or the quote unquote Cajun national anthem. It's surprising. Yeah, well, I had no idea. I've got I've got family that live about forty five minutes outside of uh, Baton Rouge, and I used to spend my summers there for many many a year, probably about twenty years or so. And of course, I've been down for Mardi Gras and um, for my nineteenth birthday. Um, stayed on a uh, in the French Quarter, right outside of um, Bourbon Street, and just like you know, walked the streets and hung out and everything. That was fun, although shitty. Was the the dude that I, one of my brothers uh, basically that I was gonna go with stood me up literally within the last like two hours before the flight took off. So I'm sitting with my you know dick in my hand at the airport. Uh, but it ended up being a good trip anyway. But I got to jump off here. Um, we got to get ready for Game of Thrones so that way Donna can cover it for work. So it is it is all hands on deck right before that shit goes up. So uh, I think the plan is for her to stream midday on Tuesday to try and get back on schedule with, with uh, Donna Ocracy and... Uh, maybe we'll try out some midweek streaming or whatever if we're, we're feeling feisty. But uh, other than that, we should see you guys uh, Thursday, Friday. So hit us up on Twitter, join me on Discord, whatever, whatever. Uh, but I hope you guys have a good rest of the weekend. If you watch Game of Thrones, I hope you enjoy it. And I will see you guys next time.